This, if you're a fan like me, you'll agree that your only young toys is among the best sitcoms ever. So do you want to join me today? Grab a chair, sit by the campfire, and we'll live this great show together. We'll travel through the entire cast, past and present, reminiscing about those who have left us and celebrating those who still shine. Are you ready? Let's dive in and rekindle some incredible memories. Charmy and May played the character Miss Milton in a sitcom when she was 40 years old in 1977. Sadly, on October 24th, 2002, she left us due to cancer in Pearlbrook, Hampshire, England. We're deeply saddened by passing. She won't be able to do what for herself? I see. Well, I hope she understands there's no one here to do it for her. <laughs> one moment. Fine. How about... No! I get to pick. I'll have... her. Oh. Harry Landis played the character Jaime in the sitcom when he was 52 in 1978. Sadly, on September 11, 2022, he left us due to cancer at 95 in England. We're deeply saddened by his passing. <laughs> That's right, he's just brought her back from her graves end graveside. Oh, and she left this in your cap. So that's my fault already? But what is it? To me, it's a sh An annoying man with a bucket of popcorn. I'm sorry you missed your film. The doc said I, I needed to sleep, so... Gretchen Franklin played the character Gypsy Magdalena in a sitcom when she was 70 years old in 1981. Sadly, on July 11, 2005, she left us due to natural causes at 94 in Barnes, London, England. We're deeply saddened by passing. Well, Just a quick idea. Hello there. I'm a true believer. Oh, still want pain? Oh, yes, of course. Well, here's one pound. Well, I've got witnesses. <laughs> Daddy is sometimes not altogether logical. He offered me marriage. <laughs> Look. Peggy Mount played the character Flora Petty in a sitcom when she was 62 in 1977. Sadly, on November 13, 2001, she left us due to illness at 86 in Northwood, London, England. We're deeply saddened by passing. For how long? I see. At an interest rate of... That would be... <coughs> so I went on to the other side of the state and I blew in this milk bottle. And Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, I was all right. But Saturday, I suddenly thought, I'm blue. Frank Williams played the character Horace Maddox in a sitcom when he was 48 in 1979. Sadly, on June 26, 2022, he left us of natural causes at 90 years old in London, England. We're deeply saddened by his passing. Hey, well, uh, bless you. Um, <laughs> well, that's rather taken the wind out of my sails. I, I came in here to be very cross with you, Mr. Mannering. We do hope you have a, have a wonderful time and uh, hopefully Next year, we may be able to be with you. Ronnie and I both send our love. Lally Bowers played the character Dolly Love in the sitcom when she was 63 in 1977. Sadly, on July 18, 1984, she left us due to natural causes at 70 in London, England, UK. We're deeply saddened by passing. They were going to make a musical of it. I was up for Roma Beaumont's sister. I'd have paid money to see that. Whatever went wrong? War broke out. <laughs> Young man coming. Young man? <laughs> well, what do you call him? Mike. <laughs> Pat Coombs played the character Cecil Lopine in the sitcom when she was 51 years old in 1977. Sadly, on May 25th, 2002, she left us due to osteoporosis at 75 in Northwood, London, England. We're deeply saddened by passing. Dolly found out that he smokes 10 cigarettes a day. <laughs> Mildred found out that he reads the Financial Times and Katie found out that he goes to church on his mother's birth. They couldn't afford <laughs> a, a new tea set or breakfast <laughs> set every week. So they bought one, I think, at Woolworths. White, you know, heavy china. And it was... George Innes played the character Surgeon Hobble in a sitcom when he was 39 years old in 1977. See, at the age of 85, he is living a fulfilling life full of passion right here in East London, England. At the letter. <laughs> I've come to the conclusion that the writer has access to a blue biro and a white pen. 
Joe Gladwin played the character Mr. Handy in a sitcom when he was 72 in 1978. Sadly, on March 11, 1987, he left us due to bronchial cancer at 81 in Manchester, England. We're deeply saddened by his passing. Billy and Maureen, did they get away all right? That's it, isn't it? Is it? That's why I left Paul Starsky with you. Paul Starsky? He means child. Diana King played the character Mildred Fanshawe in the sitcom when she was 59 in 1977. Sadly, on July 31st, 1986, she left us due to myelitis at 67 in Nettles, Oxfordshire, England. We're deeply saddened by passing. Rather unusual on my Honda. Like what, for instance? Not the red light. I think Hubble was very unfair about that. Why? Arthur Hewlett played the character Vicar in the sitcom when he was 72 in 1979. Sadly, on February 25th, 1997, he left us due to natural causes at 89 in Camden, London, England. We're deeply saddened by his passing. I swallowed a snooker ball. Nothing, no, no, no. <laughs> What colour was it this time? Yellow. Well, thank God it weren't black. That really would have mucked up. Johnny Wade played the character Roger in the sitcom when he was 45 in 1977. See, at the age of 91, he is living a fulfilling life full of passion right here in London, England. You haven't got any prunes in here, have you? Oh, don't mind my asking, only uh, Miss Milton asked me to keep a look. Here, what's your pension books doing in here? <laughs> Simon Oates played the character Luigi in the sitcom when he was 49 in 1981. Sadly, on May 20th, 2009, he left us due to a long illness at 77 in his born at Sussex, England. We're deeply saddened by his passing. Oh, I should hope. <laughs> He's a, not a writer now. <laughs> Six pounds sixty, that's 12p more. I forget to the custard cream. Okay, let's chat. Who is your favorite character in your only young toys? Please comment and share interesting things below this video. And as always, show some love. Hit the like button, subscribe for more, and hit the bell to never miss my new content. I can't wait to create more wonderful memories with you. Thanks so much and stay tuned for more. See you again as soon as possible.